Hi, C-Stars. Today, I will show you how to make a subscribe button overlay with a green screen. So if you want a subscribe button like this, then keep watching because I'm going to show you step by step on how to do it. First, go to your YouTube page and search up Canva. So just search up Canva. And then the first one should be the right one, but this one is an ad, so be careful. So I'm going to go to this one. Also, in your web browser, you can type in canva.com, and I will show you how to type it on screen. Then, you have to make an account or sign into an account, and then go to the search bar and search up thumbnail. Then, it will open a new tab, and simply click create YouTube thumbnail that is blank. Then select the square, so there should be a big square, so it's just select that and change the color to green because this is going to be an overlay, so when you go to edit it, this into your video, you'll be able to with the chroma key feature. Then just click anywhere and then it should go away. Next, go to element. Next, go to shapes, then click on the square, then shape it as a rectangle. Then go to the square, then change the color to your custom YouTube color. Change it to your YouTube theme. My YouTube theme is light blue, so I'm going to choose that theme. Once you've picked that, you're going to click in the square again but this time make it smaller and make it a different color so it can stand out so i'm going to pick white so it can stand out i recommend using white because it goes with every single color then put it in the square like that then get the triangle so we can make a youtube sign i recommend it making it the side like the color of your YouTube sign. So the YouTube rectangle is what I recommend the triangle color be. Once you're done adjusting your triangle, go to the text section, click add a subheading, and then type in the word subscribe. To change the color, go to the A symbol that has the rainbow line under it. And also to adjust the size, go to the numbers. Then I recommend 42 so it fits in your subscribe button. Then to change the font, all you have to do is click on the text and go there and choose any font. So I'm going to take a while to choose my font, so I'm going to speed this up. <laughs> elements and search up arrow you can search up search up an arrow so it will be pointing to your subscribe button or you can search up cursor like your mouse cursor i noticed that lots of the cursors have a watermark on it because it's the paid version but you can just have the watermark on it. But personally, the watermark won't really matter. If you change the color to white, the watermark won't be shown. So just change it to white. 
So just change the color to white and then the watermark will be automatically covered. So that's a quick tip for if you don't want a watermark on your pointer. Now we are going to animate it. So just go to the animate part. Then you'll pick any type of animation that you want except the ones that are paid for. If you want to use the one that is paid for, you have to actually pay for it. And yeah, so you can just make it and I choose the pan one. If you want them all together, just select them all and click group. And then once you do that, you can do the animation and it will be all together. So pick the animation that you want. If you want to view your animation, just click on the play button and then you can adjust see if you like it or not then click download since we used one that was paid for just go to the white part down at the bottom and click download a free watermark draft now it will download to your device if you enjoyed this video and you want more tutorials, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And here is the positive quote of the day.